Hello everybody and welcome to the Whiskey Dictionary. It's been a little while since I've talked about glasses on this channel and there's kind of a reason for that. Oftentimes they're a little boring, but something special kind of made me broach the topic again. Now you might remember about a year and a half ago when the Grand Canyon and the Everest glass were released. This was a Kickstarter that did really, really well, like dozens of times over its goal. And that kind of thing is happening again. So, Leotin, which is the company that makes these glasses, is putting out four new designs. They're doing Denali, K2, Mont Blanc, and Mount Fuji. And I gotta say, I think the Mount Fuji one looks the coolest, but I got wind of this and I actually reached out to them and I said, hey, I wanna help you guys promote this thing because they're cool. And everybody, I mean, so far, everybody I've talked to loves the Grand Canyon one. The Mount Everest one, I think maybe, maybe they don't realize how cool this is. So just, I'm gonna take a quick tangent here. If you've seen the Mount Everest glass, there's this cool thing where they actually have made the base camps equal to standard pours, right? You get a one and a half, you have a two and a three ounce pour at the summit of the uh, mountain, which just super cool to include that in their engineering. And this is the kind of stuff that they've been promoting with their new Kickstarter too. One of the things that you could do is put this glass in the freezer, specifically the, the uh, Everest glass, and when you pour your whiskey in here, the idea is that it chills it to, you know, basically cold, really nice uh, in 18 seconds. Now, I don't know about that. Sounds cool. I don't typically drink my whiskey chilled, but if you do, then it makes sense for you too. So I think that's neat. And they've kind of gone forth and brought that same kind of technology to the new four peaks, the idea that you could chill it and have your whiskey chilled. Now, I know that this is a whiskey channel and many of you come here for like nosing and tasting, but not always do you need to be working when you're drinking your whiskey. It's fun to nose your whiskey for sure. And you're gonna, you know, if you nose out of here, you're gonna get some stuff, probably some of the more broad nose uh, notes, but you're not gonna be sniffing it like a Glen Karen. And that's not what this is for. Sometimes it's cool to actually just sit back and have a nice heavy glass in your hand and just enjoy your whiskey. Like maybe you're outside, maybe you're sitting on the, on the deck or maybe you're just sitting watching TV. It's not always about the, the process of drinking whiskey. Sometimes it's just about drinking whiskey. So anyway, I wanted to let you guys know about this Kickstarter that's starting up because it's already like doing really, really well. It's uh, goal was $10,000. It's already over 200,000 while I'm filming this. So if you want to get in, usually Kickstarters are a great way to get a good price on something. You can usually pay a lot less than you would pay otherwise. So I'm going to leave a link down in the description below. It is an affiliate link, so just letting you know, um, but it's just cool. And I kind of missed the boat a little bit on the Grand Canyon and the and the Everest one. I didn't talk about it for a while. I don't want to miss the boat again on this because these four mountains look awesome. <laughs> anyway, all right. So check out the links below and I hope that you enjoy these glasses if you choose to get them. Um, I'm also going to be giving away a box of the Grand Canyon, I believe. Um, I actually asked them just to send me an extra box so I can give it away on a live stream. So next week's live stream, I'm going to be giving away a box of this. So check that out and I will see you guys next week. Cheers.